How to fix VMMEM high memory usage on Windows 11. Method 1. Shut down WSL. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. Type PowerShell in the Run dialog and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open PowerShell as an administrator. In the PowerShell window, type in WSL dash dash shutdown and press the Enter key. Executing this command will terminate all running WSL distributions. Method 2. Restart WSL. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. Type PowerShell in the Run dialog and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open PowerShell as an administrator. In the PowerShell window, type in WSL dash dash shutdown and press Enter. Running this command will terminate all running WSL distributions. Launching any distribution will restart WSL. If you want to shut down a specific distribution, type in WSL.exe dash L dash V and press enter. A list of all running and stop distributions on your system will appear. Then type in WSL.exe dash T distribution name and press enter to terminate the chosen distribution. To restart a specific distribution, type in WSL.exe dash D distribution name and press enter to restart the distribution. Method 3. Limit WSL memory and CPU usage. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. Type PowerShell in the Run dialog, and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open PowerShell as an administrator. In the PowerShell window, type in WSL dash dash shutdown, and press the Enter key to execute the command. Close PowerShell and open WSL. In the WSL window, type in editor dollar sign WSL path C colon backslash users backslash your username backslash dot WSL config and press enter. Then type in WSL2 memory equals 2 GB processors equals 2. This will limit your WSL virtual machine to using the memory size and number of virtual processes specified. However, you can specify the memory size and number of virtual processors depending on your needs. Hold down Ctrl plus X keys. Press the Y key when prompted to save the changes. Press Enter to confirm the location. Close the WSL window. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. Type PowerShell in the Run dialog, and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open PowerShell as an administrator. In the PowerShell window, type in WSL dash dash shutdown and press Enter. Close PowerShell and open WSL again. To confirm that the resources were allocated successfully, type in free dash h dash dash giga and press enter. Hopefully, this video provided you with the information you were looking for. If you're using a Windows computer, we suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. Combo Cleaner's real-time anti-malware scanner will stop malware from gaining a foothold on your PC. 
Anti-ransomware protection will protect your most precious files against being encrypted by ransomware. Combo Cleaner's web browsing protection will block scams, malicious websites, and downloads. Also, Combo Cleaner's duplicate file finder and big files finder will help you clean up your PC and save gigabytes of valuable disk space. Don't let malware wreak havoc on your computer. Download Combo Cleaner today. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.